Next, I'm going to discuss about the drain method of this program. So if you debug the code, control comes to main on function. Here after that, go inside. So I have taken uh, three integer variable x, uh, y, and length. So add here length initialized to 0 and add here I have taken two character variable str1 and str2 So both are array type and str1 I have given size 12 and str2 I have given size 15. So add your enter the string. So whatever I am going to enter, so that go to str1. So keep in mind one thing, add your I have given the size of str1 or 12. So you have to give or 12 character maximum. So if you want to give uh, more, more than 12, so you have to increase the size of str1. So I tell whatever I am going to enter, so that received by str1. So I am going to enter rayon. So this is this all are stored in array. So I am going to do the indexing. So this is r is 0 position y 1 position a 2 position and and 3 position so here after control comes to this point so x start from 0 so str1 of a 0 position not equal to null so str of 0 position r is there so r not equal to null the condition is True. So that coincide. So at here that increase the value of len. So len become 0 to 1. Now y become 0. Now here after that to go up and increase the value of x. So x become 1. That check the condition str 1 of 1 position. So 1 of 1 position y is there y not equal to null the condition is true so that increase the value of len uh, so len is now 2 and y is 0 so here after x gonna increase by 1 so x become 2 check the condition str1 of 2 position 2 position a is there a not equal to null the condition is uh, true so that increase the value of len so len become 3 now so here after y0 and x gonna increase by 1 so x is now 3 check the condition str1 of 3 position so 3 position n is there n not equal to no, the condition is true so that coincide and that increase the value of len so len become 4 now y0 so x gonna increase by 1 so x is now 4 so str4 position is null so at here total size of array is R12 so 0 1 2 3 or till 11 so whatever other value inside of array that all are null so no any character or till 11 so this position null is the str4 position 5th, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So that position null character is there. So I tell str4 of position not equal to null. So this value is now null for position. This is null. So condition is not true. So control comes to this point. So I tell len minus 1. So len is now 4, 4 minus 1, or this value 3, 3 go to x. So right here, x value is now 3 and here that check the condition 3 greater than equal to 0 condition is true. So that go inside. So str2 of y. So y position is now 0. 
So I have to str2 This is str2 So this is 0 position 1 or 2 3 and or till this continuum of 40 so right here str 2 of 0 position so 0 position so str 1 x position is now 3 so 3 position what value we have n so n value will go to str 2 of 0 so this position that is to n now here after y gonna increase by 1 so y become 1 so here after that go up and decrease the value of x so x become 2 now check the condition 2 greater than equal to 0 condition is true so that coincide str2 of y so y position is now 1 so str2 y position so right here str1 x value is now 2 so str 1 of 2 position, 2 position a value is there. So a value go to str2 of 1 position. So this place that go a. Now hereafter y gonna increase by 1. So y become 2 now. And x or decrease by 1. So x is now 1. Check the condition 1 greater than equal to 0. Condition is 2. So str y value is now 2 so str2 so str1 of x so str1 x value is now 1 so 1 position or oh, y is there so y value go to str2 of or 2 so this our position y star and hereafter y gonna increase by 1 so y become 3 and that decrease the value of x so x become 0 check the condition 0 equal to 0 condition is true so that coincide so at here str1 of 0 position r is there so r value go to str2 of 3 so 3 position that is to r and now y gonna increase by 1 so y become 4 and add here that or decrease the value of x so x become minus 1 check the condition minus 1 greater than equal to 0 the condition is not true so control comes to this point so add here str2 so this value is now y value 4 uh, so 4 position that is to null character And hereafter control comes to this point so this or display into the output screen and the value of str2 so str2 value is in a y r and hereafter that out from main function so final output we have this so this is the trying method of this program so i hope guys you understand so thanks for watching see you next video